the time here on TV. And I'm like, get her a speaker bar. Brilliant. All right. Think about, this is one of those items that we bring into the show that is perfect for the show because it is completely clever, right? Show's called Now That's Clever. I don't know how many of you out there have batteries and maybe you've got them in a jar. Maybe you got some in one drawer, some in another drawer. Maybe you got some in your car. Maybe you got one in your purse. You got some in that third drawer down on the left there. They're all mixed up. What if you had a way to organize all your batteries, which would not only organize them, but let you know when you were low so you could get more batteries? What if I also was going to give you a way to test your batteries to make sure that they were good so you weren't saving batteries that were useless? What if there was a way to store your batteries so they wouldn't touch each other, which decharges or discharges the battery and, and you lose battery life on the battery itself? What if I told you that not only do I have one way to do it, but I'm gonna double it up on the offer and give you two of these. This comes to us from Flippo, love that company. It's a two pack of battery organizing storage cases. And these things are brilliant. When you look at how they're set up, check it out. We've got one set up here. So all your various batteries, whatever it is you have, whether you got the triple A's, double A's, C's, D's, transistor batteries, whatever. And then you've got the little charger or the little uh, uh, charge reader that tells you whether your batteries are good. The whole thing zips up and you get two of them. Absolutely brilliant. Let me give you colors. And then we'll get Danielle on, the, on our Skype. So colors today, it comes in raspberry, this is black. Uh, over here is slate gray. Uh, this is teal. You get two of those. And then I've got, since this was a birthday surprise, I've got the navy. And you get two of these. Well, you know what I love about these two? The compact size. These will go anywhere. You can keep one in your car, keep one in your camper, your boat, your RV, right? Whatever you've got or keep one at home. You're gonna love it and you get two. And here is the lovely Danielle Lopez. She's our home contributor. Danielle, welcome to the show. It's the first time I get to work with you. Very exciting. Yes. <laughs> Hi, Guy. Hello. Yes, I'm so excited to tell you about this clever, it's truly a clever idea from Flippo. Because where are your batteries right now, right? Most people have them thrown in a junk drawer like this. I mean, does this look familiar? You're digging around for double AA, A, triple A batteries. And you know, this is gonna change the way you store your batteries. I've been a culprit of this, but this has truly changed the way I store my batteries. It holds 60 batteries. You've got those 24 double AA, 26 triple A. So you're no longer digging around for those. Got them all right here. Two C's, two D's, two nine volts. And you wanna make sure you have those around. Those are going in your smoke detectors. You even have four slots for those easy to lose button cell batteries. Those go in your keyless car entry keys or your kids toys. Now you mentioned the tester. You're getting two cases and you're also getting two testers. This is so user friendly. All you're gonna do is slip a battery in here, a battery of any size also. It slides up to tell you the size of the battery. And then you've got a clear box over here with a red toggle. If the toggle's in the green, battery's good. If it's in the red, the battery's bad and you need to replace that battery. I'll tell you why. If you've got good batteries laying around with bad batteries, those bad batteries are actually causing the good batteries to lose charge. You can lose charge in your batteries in so many ways. And that's why the way you store them is so important. This case has individual slots. They're keeping your batteries separated so you don't have them thrown in a drawer. You don't have them touching each other and that is so important. Yeah, and, and you know what? The organization, this is, this is like right up my alley, Danielle, because I was one of those people that kept batteries everywhere. I, I didn't really keep track of them. I mean, I, I, you would find C batteries in one drawer. You'd find D batteries in another drawer. Sometimes there'd just be one. I'm like, why do, why do I have one D battery in here, right? You know why I had one D battery? Because I didn't even know I had it there. And so when I needed something that needed batteries, it always needed two. And all I had was one because I never knew I was out. What's nice about this case is that you can actually keep track of when you need to go to the store and get more batteries. And then if you really wanted to, if you've got, if you recycle your batteries, you could always turn them upside down the other way, if, you know, to know that those ones have to be recycled. Or, you know, you could, you could, if you're going to keep both cases, one could be for your dead batteries, one could be for your good batteries, and you could bring those to the recycle place and then refill them with brand new batteries. But it keeps track of what you need. And you know, uh, as well as I do, Danielle, we need batteries for everything. Every remote control, all of our candles that, would, that are flameless candles, the kids' gaming systems. Um, I, I mean, I can go on and on and on. I mean, I've got, you know, even I've got the retro jukebox thing that I've, you know, that I've got C or D batteries in those machines. This is a way to be able to keep track. And you get two cases. And I love that you did the two-pack because I think 
Anybody that gets one of these would love to give one to their kids or give one to a friend because everybody probably has that same problem. All their batteries are scattered all over the house, right? Exactly. Some people have this problem and they don't even know it. And that's why you want to keep your batteries separated. If you've got them thrown in a drawer or even touching different kinds, if you have alkaline and lithium batteries touching, it's going to cause your batteries to leak and rupture. If they're rummaging around in a drawer with paper clips or coins, any metal objects, that's causing your batteries to short circuit. And people don't know this. That's why giving telling them, hey, this is going to solve a problem you have and you don't even know you have the problem. So it, it really is a good gift. And I believe we're also offering um, to fill the batteries, like to buy a, the 60 batteries, yeah. you can fill this. It's only gonna fill one of the cases. So if you wanna purchase a battery bundle, only fills one cases. If you wanna fill both, go ahead and grab two battery bundles, give one to a friend, take one to the office, like you said, put it in the RV, go on a road trip. This is perfect for a road trip. It is compact, it is going to zip right up, and it's soft yet durable. So even with 60 batteries in here, it is not heavy, which is something I love. I slip mine right in a drawer like the one behind me, and you can really take this anywhere. I, it is, it's brilliant, and, and I love the size of it. Okay, it's a very compact, version. We've carried different battery holders before. This one is really compact and it's padded so that if you, and it's got kind of a semi-soft case. So if you want to tuck this in a drawer or if you want to put this in a glove box or have this in the trunk of your car, you'll always have it. And look at how it's laid out. If you come over here, everything is organized. So we've got all of our double A's, which is, you know what, really the double A's and triple A's are the most common batteries nowadays for all our remote controls and our, you know, our alarm systems and things like that. All those right here. And then there's your triple A's and you see, we give you plenty of room for those. We we don't often use doubles um, and, and or uh, D's and C's that much, but we still use the transistor batteries. These usually go on our smoke detectors or smoke alarms. We have those. You also get one of our little battery testers, and all you do is put a battery in, you cramp it down, it'll give you an easy reading to let you know when batteries are dead. And I will tell you, I'd pay $27 for two of those because those little battery <laughs> testers are, are they're brilliant and they are so worth the money because nine out of 10 times, Danielle, the batteries you have in your drawer are dead, right? <laughs> oh yeah, exactly. And it really is, it's little things like this in life, you know, to organize that it, you really appreciate. So I know that you'll appreciate this when you get this home just like I, I love do. It. I love it. Hey, Danielle, wonderful job. Great offer. Thank love it. You. Nice to see you. Uh, we'll see you again you soon. Too. All right, take care, hunt. 715-168 is the item number. Hey, Danielle mentioned that we've got some batteries available. Why